might be raining here in Chester, but the atmosphere's certainly sunny. This city, for a whole week, will be celebrating Disability Pride Month. Now, already I've seen a parade, I've seen someone dressed as a lobster, and there's going to be lots of dancing and performer arts going on. But what is Disability Pride Month? It started as a day in the US in 1990, after a law was passed to prevent people with disabilities being discriminated against. Since then, it's evolved into a month-long event. It's a chance for the disabled community to celebrate being themselves, no matter their differences, but also to raise awareness of the challenges they still face every day to be treated equally. This is the Disability Pride flag. There are lots of different types of disabilities that affect people in different ways, and each of the colours represents these. Red is for physical disabilities. Gold is for neurodivergence like autism and ADHD. White is for invisible and undiagnosed disabilities. Blue is for mental illnesses. Green is for sensory disabilities. And they all run in parallel lines to symbolize unity and strength within the community. So what does a month like this mean to the community? I've faced a lot of challenges in my life because of my disabilities, which is autism and dyspraxia too. So it's been a space where it's inclusive, where people are here to celebrate who they are. It's really special. What went through your mind when you saw all these people with different disabilities celebrating today? Maybe in Josh and Twin celebration. Kind of made me feel one more take up. I would have fun inside. You know, just that you see discovering new people. I'm really, really pleased, really proud. I love people making happy choices. It's been amazing. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. yeah.